the first part of this, I'm gonna give a little tour of the lot and then I'll be up checking up the miner. I sell cars. I sell all kinds of stuff. I'm gonna talk about that for a minute. Dogecoin to the moon sign. Yeah, buddy. I'm gonna have to change that to say Kadena. I've been mining Kadena for about eight months. I like the coin, I like the project. I like that it's in JP Morgan's in on it. And I like doing uh, my mining on DX Pool. Um, I do all the mining for all the gold shell stuff on DX Pool. Uh, I've gotten my money from them. They've been really good to me on paying out and they're not good to me. They're doing what they're supposed to. How about that? They're doing it. So I like that. Other than that, nice hash and I've done some other mining, but those are the main two I do for this. For Bitcoin and Ethereum, I'm over on nice hash. Everything else is through DX Pool. So this video is about a KD box. Uh, KD box? Saying about a KD box? About a KD5. I did my KD box one. I've got three of those and they're plugging right along. I'm glad I started mining it when I did because they were very low priced. And I think today they almost hit five bucks. It's like a 488 and it had a little bit of resistance there coming into five. But this machine right now at this point makes over $130 a day. It is the most profitable miner in the entire world. There's not a more profitable miner out there. There's four that are as profitable and some that are more, but they're not out yet. All kinds of new cars, all kinds of new inventory. I'll be doing a walk around on all that. We got a lot of stuff out here that's been coming in and I got about five more on the way. So that's the deal, been getting a lot of cars. I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna do the whole setup of this KD5. Keep forgetting. Actually, I ordered this direct from Gold Shell back in, well, I don't know, it was August. And it was gonna be shipped in September. And then I finally got it today, here at the end of October. So that's the deal. Like I say, all kinds of cars. Here we go. All right, back here in my mining room, which basically, as you can see, has a lot to do with being my eBay room. And stuff. I got all kinds of eBay stuff in here. Look. You guys see these, I don't know where they go. What are you doing? Yeah, either you know, or you know, or you don't know. I got three of these, man, they're bad. So, gold shell miners and graphic cards, and I actually have to fill up about 12 more hard drives for Chia. This one here I'm having a problem with. I was actually trying to put the 3080 in it, and now I've got some kind of issue. I don't know what it is. Mining Chia, Mining Starcoin, and I do like Starcoin. Uh, Handshake, Nervos, Kadena, all Doge, Litecoin Doge, Bitcoin, Litecoin Doge. The one back over there, and actually, I just got power in to where I got two more um, 30 amp outlets over here. So I'm going to plug this second PDU in. And somewhere in here, I'm going to set up this. Now, this is a big day for me. I'm really happy to get this because I got the 3080 that came in. 3080 Ti, excuse me. I got a 6600 XT. This is three Synchro... Synchrobe? I don't know. They got the dot .IT. I don't know if it's Synchro Bit or Synchrobe. But, but this is my baby right here. That's my girl. That's a KD5. I wish I had bought three of them, but I sure am happy about it. This is a $50,000 a year miner at this point. This thing is making 143 bucks a day at this point. Crazy. Do I believe it's gonna keep doing it? You know, it's, there's gonna be a bear market or anything. Kadena is up to $5.20 right now. Crazy. Okay, I'm gonna get this thing split open. Talk to you in a second. We got more gold show miners over here. These are library miners. And this one had a problem with that heat sink right there falling off. And this one has a pinched wire. I don't know, I think I'm gonna hook this one up. But this is the deal, man. I'm I'm stoked. I'm almost shaking. Well, okay. Probably not, but I am pretty stoked. And man, I wish I'd have bought three. But I didn't. If they come back on there, I'm buying another one. I'll tell you that much. They have a CK5, but I'm not as much of a nervous fan. They sent me this, unfortunately. Looks like they could send you the right one in America. That would be a nice addition for them, since they can't even sell them in China. 
Um, I'm going to take this thing out here. Beautiful machine. I am so stoked to get it. Just wish I had three. Like I say, I had the money in my crypto too. I was gonna cash out and just pay for it with my Litecoin. But let me get this thing put up. All right, that's where I'm gonna set it. And let me get this thing here plugged in. I've just been cleaning up in here and cleaning up. And it seems like no matter what, there's always something more to clean up. Okay, plug the PDU in. So I'm gonna make sure this is on now. Actually, we didn't have the breaker on. And that, I think that did it. Okay, it takes a second, but then they all click on. And this here bad boy uses 2,200 watts. It's a lot. And there's my cable. And I need some internet. There it is my network cable and I'm going to turn this on and there it goes and I'm going to go in the other room and open up Yoda BC and I'll make a screenshot and show you how to mine on DX pool with a Kadena you can do it with a Litecoin L3 plus you can do it with any of the gold shells uh, most miners you can do it DX pool you heard that thing power on now. Yeah, buddy. Right now I'm mining Kadena for gold shell. Guaranteed. And actually, I was looking to have the air come out this way and not blow them things around. But, talk to you in a second. Okay, with the CK5 and the KD5, all you do is plug in your internet and then turn your miner on. From there, you don't even have to use this button unless you're using like Yoda BC or something like that. You can go to find.goldshell.com or find, I'll show you on the screen in there. But this thing's hashing away. Just plug it in, turn it on. These, you have to actually use Yoda BC. I, I got miners everywhere. I got seven more next door and more on the way. Yes, that's what the website was. It's find.goldshell.com and go there and it'll show on this internet I've got 12 and I, we use so much internet I had to get another uh, landline internet here because look at this, has got 2 hours and 38 minutes left. It's a 2.2 gigabyte video. But this miner right now there we go, is doing 143 a day, 4,300 a month, 51,600 a year, and that is after electricity, although I do not believe their electricity rate. Um, watch. Uh, how do you... I would go probably look like $3,000 or something. Just overrated, man. Who cares? You're bringing in 50 anyways. But this is a extremely profitable miner right now. As a matter of fact, the KD5 is, right now, number three. Um, and not really number three, because I want to tell you, they're actually number one. Because the two above it... And, oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, it stepped up another notch! Woo! Doo -doo -doo -doo. And you know what? It's going to be hard to get past that E9. But the point about the E9 and the A11 and the L7s is they're not out. You can't buy them. They're not out. Maybe somebody has one that they got out of a, um, they got because they're a creator or something, somebody to try it out, but they don't not, they are not out. And this KD5 is the most problem. Now, speaking of such, right now the problem is Gold Shell is getting my money. I don't want Gold Shell to get my money. Actually, I would gladly give them another $33,000 for three of these. Whoa. Please translate, please translate. Wow, that bad boy is going. How many hash? Hash, hash, hash. 
Okay, it is going, I guess. Is it? Yeah, it is. 17 terahash. Kenya. Ooh, thank you. And Gold Shield does make it pretty easy. Um, go to your miner. And I'll give them like 2S KDA. It's all good. But where is hash rate mode? Boom, pool settings at the top. I'm used to the mini doges and the mini KD boxes and CK boxes and HS boxes, and all the boxes. Okay, so I use nice hash for a lot of my mining um, for everything to do with Ethereum, like GPUs. But when it comes to the boxes and the gold shells, everything I have. Uh, library, Starcoin, Kadena, CKB, Handshake, Siacoin, and Litecoin Doge are on this. Except for my bigger Litecoin Doges, they're on the um, Nice Hash. Um, but you're going to go to KDA. And actually, we might have just been there. We can't. At the bottom of any of those pages, you'll see the Straytham or Straytham. Um, and they give you a little tutorial too if you want. Um, go back to this and we're gonna have to actually unlock our miner and it should be admin and one two three four five six seven eight nine I don't think they actually use the zero and it's that I actually will save that for this and we will get rid of your address that is the Oh, wow, they got it going to DX pool too, just to their address. We don't want that. Let's go ahead and remove that pool and add a new one. Very simple. In fact, I don't know, I forgot. Um, Gold Shield makes it really easy to just click DX pool. Bam, that's it. Now I need my miner name and password. Forgot the password, have no clue. Uh, Zero marshmallow. Uh, where'd I go? <laughs> I got too many pages open. Okay, it is on there. Let's go ahead and check out DX pool for our Kadena. And Kadena is a very touchy algorithm and there's a lot of rejected shares sometimes. Um, however, it has been my most uh, profitable algorithm by far. And my internet is going slow because I've got that stuff going down. Let's see if the sucker is mining away. It is, we are going, and not really much to set or do in these. Um, it's just pretty simple, really simple. Right now we've averaged that, and it's still pretty cool. 8% eight, eight error, reject rate of 16.67, and that should go down, especially as it gets um, over the next couple days. But let's see, Kadena. And the way I've got it set up, I don't know if I'm going to see it on there. Because I've got it ran into the same exact... Um, should, well, you should be able to tell here when a Terra hashes take off. And boom! There she is. I just refreshed this and it just snapped off all of a sudden took all of about five minutes to get all aligned and working right and after I changed the pools it just dropped down dropped right back up as a matter of fact right now it's running the 17.27 terahash it's down to a 2% hardware and a 12.7% reject so we'll see what happens here it has really been online for 15 minutes since base wow it mined for gold shell for 15 minutes do you realize every one of these they got and they're mining for them for 15 minutes? How much money they're making? Woo! Just on the extra mining. Wow, it's amazing. Okay, well, and could you imagine if you delayed your orders for about three weeks, four weeks, five, six weeks at 143 bucks a day? 
Okay, that's it. It's up and going. You were not going to get right to your, like, I should be at uh, 21 and a half or so, Terra Hash, 20, 21 to 21 and a half with all of my KDA, um, K Kadena Miners, but it's going to take a bit to get up to that as it warms up and gets moving. 519 right now on the day with a high, set a new high of like 527, I think. What did it do? Let's see. I'm going to refresh. So that's how you set up a Kadena Meyer, and I totally suggest DX Pool. Great people to work with. I just I like a seamless withdrawal, and like they have a seamless withdrawal. It's so simple, but ding just ends up my Kadena goes Kadonga. So that's that. Look at that. This region. Jeez, what did it touch? We're up to 125. Yeah, 527. Number 125. This is like 300 less. I mean, it, this is awesome. And I do love the project and believe in the project. Um, man, wish I had bought three of these. Okay, it's the next day and it's running along, plugging along. 18 terahash hardware error, only 0.41%, reject rate of 7.81. I'm gonna refresh, still at that, still at that, still at that. And that was actually like 10 minutes of not refreshing. Um, we come in here, I have 20.87, 21.82 in the one hour. So we're averaging about 21.8. So that is it. It is plugged in and moving and going. And so is Kadena at 627. It actually almost hit $7 last night. Crazy times. Loving it. So check out DX Pool. Check out the Gold Shell Miners. And subscribe to my channel and check out my other videos. We'll talk to you. All right, I've been waiting to refresh this for a while. Kadena is on a move. Kadena is at $8.17. Woo! It's like, this is crazy. This is, it's not crazy. I expected this. Okay, um, yesterday afternoon, my account assets were at 8200 I sold 950 Kadena between 360 and 470 and then, I mean, this was 35 cents five weeks ago. But let's go from 8,200 to 12,200. And I sold, I would have had 14,900 or 15,300. I lost three grand by selling half of my Kadena. But you never expect it to go from 360, 430, 360 was a big level for it. And once it broke past that, that was a support level on the way down. And on the way up, I, I haven't seen a stop for it yet. Um, I'm still selling some of it and such, but I also have miners that bring me about 40 Kadena coins a day. So every month I get 1,200 new Kadena coins that right now are worth $8. And that is five grand, six grand a month or something. I don't know. Not doing the math. Just wanted to show that. Well, that was it. Thanks for watching. Um, I've got all kinds of other mining videos on my channel. In fact, there's a playlist for the mining videos if you go to the main page. All kinds of cars, all kinds of stuff. You see it, ask me about it. It's for sale besides these two. Thanks for watching. Have a great day or night, whatever it is, wherever you are. OneOwnerCarGuy.com. All this stuff is available in the links below. Make sure to click the like, click the comment, comment below. Talk to me on the side, all that. Hopefully, have fun. We'll see you.